Hello, everybody, and welcome to our first session of program evaluation. I'm really excited to be here with you all um, for this next semester. We're going to learn a ton. Um, this is one of my favorite classes to teach, uh, mostly because it makes statistics um, really exciting. Um, for many of you in the MPA and MPP programs, you've already taken statistics one and two. Um, and you've learned how to run regressions, you've learned how to do t-tests and chi-squared tests and those kinds of things. Um, but what we'll be learning in this class is how to actually apply those things, um, those tools and those skills that you've learned, to um, measure things in society and try to prove causation. Um, so that you can you can find social programs from nonprofits and from governments, and you can see if they've had an actual impact on society. And you can measure the causal effect of these programs. And so it's really fun because um, we can actually talk about causation legally in this class. Um, in most stats classes, um, the, the, the thing that they keep drilling into your heads is correlation is not causation. Don't talk about causation ever. Um, this class is all about causation. Um, so it should be really fun and exciting. Um, plus, you'll get to learn the statistical language R, um, which is in really high demand nowadays, um, mostly because it's free. Um, you can use all of these statistics after you graduate and you lose access to Stata or SPSS or what other pack, whatever other package you used before um, this class. So it should be really fun and exciting. Um, so let's go ahead and get started with the session for today. Um, if you're on the class website, um, on this page where you're possibly watching this video. Um, there's a section with the with the slides. Um, you can either download the slides as a PDF or you can open the slides as an HTML slideshow in your browser. Um, or you should be able to click through the slideshow in the embedded picture here on the website um, using your arrow keys. Um, the fun part about this, this, these, these sets of slides is that they're all made with R. Um, the skills that we'll be learning throughout the semester um, let you do all sorts of cool, fun things with R beyond just running regressions. You can make entire websites. You can make um, interactive slideshows. Um, so go ahead and you can um, go through the slides. Um, some fun tricks that you can do if you're going through the slides or, or looking through the slides. If you press um, question mark, so if you press shift um, question mark, it'll bring up um, an on-screen menu of all of the different keyboard shortcuts you can use um, with the slideshow. Um, probably the most important for you if you want to be able to skip through is to press the O key and then that will show you an overview of all of the different slides um, so you can skip around the different parts of the presentation. Um, so let's go ahead and get started. We'll switch over to the slides here. So today, um, based on the readings that you had, we're going to be talking a lot about um, causation and data science and how that's all connected to evaluation and why we care about evaluating programs that are in the public sector. Um, it, we have kind of a duty to make sure that the programs that we, that we implement, um, it, either in the nonprofit sector or in the public sector, work. Um, we're using either donor money or taxpayer money, so we want to make sure that the things that we're doing as a nonprofit or a government have an actual measurable effect and we're not just wasting money. Um, so we care about this a lot, and so um, we can use these, these fun and exciting tools of, of data science and causation to help prove that story. Um, so what we're going to be covering today is uh, a few things. Um, we'll first talk briefly about the connection between data science and public service, and we'll define what data science is. It's kind of a buzzword nowadays. Everybody loves data scientists, um, but nobody really knows what they are. Um, and so we'll, we'll define uh, what data science is for the sake of this class and how that's connected to public and nonprofit service. Um, then we'll talk briefly about this idea of causation and the role of evidence in the policymaking process and in the program implementation process and why we care about gathering evidence. Um, and then we'll give some uh, brief overview of some class details explaining how the class will work um, for the next um, few weeks while we're together in this semester. And then that should be it for today. Um, after this, you should be able to complete the um, assignment. Um, the first problem set involves some initial R work. You'll get introduced to how R and R Studio work. Um, and there's other videos um, that will help you through that process. And so um, it should be fun and exciting. So let's go ahead and get started. <laughs> 